So for the sake of saving time, I kind of made a little slideshow of what we can expect with the 4000 series launch. This is aimed at gamers. So I'm just gonna show you a little slideshow of the performance specs, etc. what I found. So you don't have to watch the whole video and I'm just gonna keep this short and decisive. So what they announced is the Nvidia 4000 series. And of course they have made claims of insane new performance. And well, we're gonna start off with this. So they're repricing the 3000 series cards and they will become cheaper, duh. And they have made claims that the 4080 is gonna start off at around $900. Yeah, that's not gonna happen. So that sums that first part up. Now, I found a little spec sheet here, which says that the 4090 will have 24 gigabytes of GDDR6X and that is pretty much on par with the 3090 Ti. And well, here are the clock speeds and the CUDA cores, pretty good. So we have a 4080 with 16 gigabytes and a 4080 with 12 gigabytes of VRAM. Now, here is a little overview of if they compare the 4080 with the 3080. So I don't know how much is this, around 40, 45% faster. Is they claim in cyberpunk that is a little different i think that has to do with the new ray trace overdrive or with dlss 3 yeah i think it's dlss 3 so but we'll see more of that in a second so this is compared to the 3080 which is in gray and well the 16 gigabytes 4080 looks pretty juicy so if you're interested in this kind of stuff, by the way, I am going to buy all of these cards. So make sure you're subscribed. Okay, next one. So the 4080 starts at 900, as they claim. Yeah, <laughs> available in November. 16 gigabytes starts at around 1200. I'd say that's a fair leap. And it's two to four times faster than the 3080. Are you sure about that? <laughs> okay. So here is the 4090 uh, compared to the 3090 RIP 3090 compared, compared to Cyberpunk. I don't know if this is true, but you know, I'm going to test that on the channel when I get the card. So this is compared to the 3090, 4090, 24 gigabytes. This one is also 24 gigabytes. So and the 3090 or sorry the 4090 it starts at 1600 most likely more like 2000 but hey we'll burn that bridge when we get there and well this is a little slideshow of the what was it i think this is the dlss part yeah so this said they have added dlss 3 I think the 3080s will not support DLSS 3, which is very weird in my opinion. But and well, this is DLSS 1, DLSS 2. So they're kind of showing here how much they have improved everything. A lot of bloody, bloody, blah, blah, but hey, more performance. And this is Nvidia Turing versus Ampere versus Ada Lovelace. And well, they're kind of showing off how good it is. In reality, we'll just have to see if that is really the case. So that was a very quick summary of what you have missed or haven't missed. And there's the videos down in the description if you wanna see the rest of the entire video of NVIDIA. But I just made a little clip here, so you have it in short. And I think for most gamers, this is the most interesting part of what they have launched. So thanks for watching, leave a like if you did, and I'll catch you in the next one. Peace.